back now to note of it where we're getting an update on COVID-19. Let's listen. To date is 4,141 and 785 persons are still being followed. Sadly, the spread of COVID-19 is normal. Transmission will happen. Our rise in cases over the past few days is significant and seems scary. But we did know they would rise once the virus was in the territory. Now it is important we plank these numbers and focus on what we need to do to make that happen. Today, Nunavut enters its two-week lockdown. This is it, folks. It's time to take a stand and fight against COVID-19. We need you all to make sacrifices now to protect our communities. This means don't visit outside your household, don't gather or socialize, don't travel until, unless absolutely necessary. If you go to do errands, run to the store, go alone, wear a mask and keep distance from others. Work or learn from home unless you are considered, considered essential worker. It means stay home and give us a chance to manage, contain and limit the spread of the virus in Nunavut. As always, wash your hands, cough into your elbow, clean surfaces regularly. I know this will be hard, so I'm asking that you reach out if you're struggling to friends, to family, to loved ones and beyond if you need to. I've posted a toll-free number and resources on my social media about how to get help if you need it. Two weeks. We have the opportunity to turn this around in two weeks. If we don't stick to these measures, it can be longer and possibly much longer. Elders can't have visitors. Kids can't be at school. Frontline workers are working around the clock. Nunavut, don't make this lockdown be for nothing. It's up to each of us. Do your part to slow down the spread of COVID-19. Stay well, stay safe, and stay home. And I thank all of the Nunavut Mule. Good morning. As of today, Nunavut has a total of 70 cases of COVID-19. Eight new cases have been confirmed in Aviat, bringing the community total to 54. And there were two new cases in Rankin Inlet, bringing the community total there to six. Our rapid response teams, who I must commend for their hard work and dedication, are working to test, trace, and contain the virus in all communities impacted. To date, there have been 114 negative tests in Aviat, 60 negative tests in Rankin Inlet, 103 in Santa Kilowack and five negatives in Whale Cove. Contact tracing and testing is ongoing. Takwalumakulutik <laughs> Ulumimut Tako one hundred fourteen Nova John Nakhangin Narata Yukhaya Sartaus Mayo Arviani and Malo sixty Ulutik Nova John Nakhangi to Khaya Sartaus Mayo Kanya Sinami one hundred three Sanikilo Mikhaya Sartaus Mayut Nova John Nakhangi to Amalo Taliman Nova John Nakhangi to Tikira Joa Mikhaya Sartaus Mayut Katiyao Simaning in Khaya Sapalayut and Malo Khaya Sapalayaning Sulikayo Sijum. 